Afrobeast News. So the one and only Steph Don Big Steph herself, Big Don herself, recently previewed a new song with none other than Buju Benson. And guys, I find this particularly interesting. Now, the reason I find this very interesting is because of the fact that Buju Benson used to be signed to Bonaboy. In case some of you guys don't know, there's a backstory between Buju Benson and Bonaboy, right? Buju Benson used to be signed to Bonaboy's record label, the Spaceship record label. That record label is managed by Bonaboy's mom, Boss Ogulu, and I think the record label also have Bonaboy's sister on that record label. So, Buju Benson used to be under that record label, and when he was under the record label, he was popping, but he didn't really become as big as, you know, we've gotten to see you know Buju Benson become right so anyway at some point Buju Benson left the record label it felt like there was some little dispute here and there but nothing really big came out of it Buju Benson left and then started dropping hits back to back to back and became a household name in Nigeria and yeah that's the story behind Buju Benson and Bona Boy relationship now it seems very interesting that of all people that Steph London could have done a collaboration with she decided that she was going to do a collaboration with Buju Benson, same guy that left Bonaboy's record label. And aside from that, in this particular song, she decided to announce to the world that she was single. So guys, a very interesting one coming up, Buju Benson, Steph London collaboration, well it's what's popping? Just like ooh, what's popping? I like you, what's popping? Ooh. What's good, what's popping? Just like just like oh what's poppin'? I like you, what's poppin'? Oh, what's good, what's poppin'? Yes, I'm single, but I'm not joking. Cause I'm scared you gon' leave me broken. Guys, what do you think about this particular one? And let me just make this thing clear. I think this song sounds fantastic. This song might end up becoming a hit and anthem. It just sounds very catchy, man. Steph put you, put you, of course, the vocals and Steph as well did not disappoint on this one. Guys, again, tell me your opinion. What do you think about this particular one? Steph London, do you think that she's taking somewhat of a sub to shade at Bonner Boy or not? And guys, you made that don't forget to like and subscribe, turn on post notification and stay soon for more Afrobeats related entertainment and just coming at GMF now guys. Peace.